Good day, fellow Asgardians. Lena Devina here, talking to you today about the first in history parliamentary elections of Asgardia. As you all know, according to the Asgardian constitution, the elections are taking place within six months from the date of accepting the constitution. Therefore, the final voting will take place in the first week of March 2018. And already now, everyone who is an Asgardian can self-nominate for the parliament or the other positions in the government. According to the constitution, parliamentary candidates need to be above the age of 40, but all the other Asgardians who are above 18 have an opportunity also to work in support of the parliament or in the government positions. Therefore, if you see yourself in the future working for Asgardia, please take this opportunity to make yourself known to the community, share your thoughts and your vision on the pages at asgardia.space. In total, there will be 150 parliamentary members, but this is the ultimate final number, and this is formed in line with the district representations per language. However, at the moment, if there are fewer candidates, we will end up having a parliament with fewer seats in total. At the moment, for example, as of today, when I am making this recording, there are not enough applicants in some language groups. So by all means, please go online, check what's happening in the districts, think which brilliant people should be with us and Asgardia, encourage them to join us, encourage them to self-nominate for the Asgardian parliament. Ultimately, after the voting is completed, the Central Electoral Commission will count the results, which will be announced within the course of the next few weeks. After that, Parliament will start its work, and that will include also appointment of the government. And this is where it comes in handy, what I spoke about earlier. If you consider working for the government, please already now nominate yourself, present yourself. So the parliamentary members know who you are, as guardians know who you are. This is your chance to make a statement to the community that you want to work with Asgardia and for Asgardia. Parliamentary elections for now will take place every time the population of Asgardia doubles. That's logical because at the moment the districts are formed in proportion to the number of people who selected their languages. So the moment there are many more Asgardians, there will be different proportion in the languages, maybe more or maybe less. But in any case, doubling of the population is a reason to call for the new elections. But in any case, if you nominated yourself, if you submitted your fee, you already paid it. Even if there is a rerun for the new parliament session, you are already in it. Go and run for parliamentary elections again. Everybody who nominates himself for Asgardian parliament is requested to make a symbolic donation to Asgardia. This is simply to make sure that people are taking seriously and respectfully what is happening. The amount which is asked is 100 euros, and if you have already donated to Asgardia earlier, that is deducted from this total amount. The question has been asked, uh, why is it announced later that there is a fee for registering oneself as a candidate than the start of the election campaign? The answer is very simple. Yet again, we are doing something brand new for the first time ever. And those of you who are with us since the beginning or since some months at least already know that we are doing our best to work for you and for Asgardia. And some things get more clear on the way and we adjust and we adapt as we progress. As we have looked into best practices around the world, we came to the conclusion that as a matter of seriousness of the commitment, it's feasible to ask some symbolic contribution during the registration for administrative processing of the application form. Everyone is welcome to support their candidates by helping them collect this 100 euros nomination fee. So if you are voting for the candidate and want to contribute to the registration fee, make sure to do donation, but it should be marked as in support of candidate such and such. And it should be clearly stated 
what is your email and for whom you are voting. This way we can be sure that not only your vote, but also the contribution to the registration fee for the nomination is clearly marked and goes towards the campaign of the candidate. In terms of work of the parliament as a legislative body, it will be elaborating the laws and it will be preparing for the first assembly. The first general assembly of the parliament of Asgardia will take place between 22nd and 26th of June 2018 in Vienna. This is when the members of parliament and top level officials will meet live for the first time. And this is their opportunity to discuss and to work in sessions to take further their original deliberations on how to run Asgardia. It is also important to note that all the financing of Asgardia from the day of its founding on the 12th of October 2016 was done exclusively and only from private funds of Dr. Shurbeli. Dr. Shurbeli is committed to bringing Asgardia to functional level system, in other words, to holding it in parliament session till the 1st of July 2018, all activities are funded. One of the tasks of the parliament is to determine the economical system of Asgardia. To this purpose, already now, we are launching a contest for ecosystem of Asgardia, economical system of Asgardia. Please take part in the contest. Please reach out to the people you know, to the brilliant minds out there. So everybody who has any ideas about financial economic systems and how to approach creatively the new state should be on board. Please invite them to compete, even if they have not joined Asgardia yet. Towards the end of April, we will hold the round table where the shortlisted winners of the proposed ecosystems will get together and debate their proposals in front of a nominated panel of experts. You still have a chance to nominate yourself and you are certainly having a chance to have a great impact on shaping Asgardia's future by voting for the candidates in all the districts. You can vote for as many people in the district as there are seats in that district. So ultimately you're voting for the whole parliament of Asgardia. Please take your time to study the programs and to support your favorite candidates. If there are any questions, you can write to elections at asgardia.space. They will help you to go with self-nomination procedure if you have doubts how to do that, or if you have any other questions in conjunction with the elections of Asgardia. Please nominate yourself. Please vote.